She could become the first person in the UK and probably the world to have air pollution listed as a cause of death. Ella Kisi Deborah died after having a severe asthma attack in 2013. Her mother, a campaigner for improvements to air quality, is hoping to finally have answers after a second coroner's inquest. All children deserve the right to breathe clean air and it's up to government to do things to clean up the, the air for children. A first inquest in 2014 ruled that Ella died of acute respiratory failure. But a review by air pollution expert Stephen Holgate led to the finding being overturned. Before her death, Ella was taken to hospital nearly 30 times with breathing difficulties. Holgate linked her admissions to high levels of nitrogen dioxide where she lived, near a busy and regularly congested road in southeast London, and concluded that Ella's death coincided with one of the worst air pollution surges in her area. Stephen Holgate said without the illegal levels of air pollution, he believes that my daughter would still be alive now. And that's quite a hard thing to take. According to Public Health England, air pollution is believed to contribute to between 28 and 36,000 deaths across the UK every year.